Hi everyone. So uh, increasingly more and more we're seeing uh, computers, uh, Apple computers being infected with malicious software. Um, I'm going to show you the um, free and quick and easy way to get rid of these uh, infections. They tend to be limited to just um, infecting your Safari uh, and um, any other browsers that you might have installed on your computer. And <clears throat> there's a quick and easy way to get rid of these um, infections. Okay, so uh, I'm, as you can see, I've got an infection on this computer here. I've got pop-ups. Um, it's taken over my search, um, so I can't have Google search. If I put it back to Google, restart the computer, it comes back again. So the quick and easy way to get rid of that is to go into the um, Apple App Store, um, do a search for Bitdefender, and we want to install this one here. Um, it's free, um, so don't confuse that with the uh, expensive one uh, which is well, it's 22 pounds in the UK or it's probably about $30 in America so um, so the uh, Bitdefender is the one you want so I've pre-installed that so I'm gonna go down over here and see that I've already run a faux deep system scan and what you should do is before you run the scan is make sure that it's up to date so there'll be an update button make sure you press that and get it up to date. Um, so you will find that once you've done the scan, you've got um, infections here, um, a list of infections, and then you've got a close button and a review and finder. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna be pressing this review and finder, and there's a little trick to using this. Um, uh, it tends to be as well with this, that it can't remove it. It says disinfection, um, it can't disinfect the file. <coughs> it can't remove uh, the object, can't quarantine it and all that. So this is for those. Uh, so I'm gonna reveal, go to the top one, I'm gonna reveal and find her. And what you'll find is that um, you, you'll have one file there that it wants to get rid of. And the trick here is not to get rid of that one, but to go further back. So if you're in cover, cover flow view, change it, and you wanna use this little symbol here with the three windows, and you wanna use that and then scroll back until you find the actual package it, where it comes from so for example this one says agent and then if we go further back you'll find agent and it's located in a folder called 995b you know you can tell that's not something that you want um, so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to drag that straight into the bin it's probably going to ask me for a password uh, so i'm going to pop that in the bin uh, yeah, there we go. So I just press OK to that because um, I haven't got a password in there. Uh, and then I'll go to the next one. And you might find now that if I go to the next one, Reveal and Find is missing. That means I've already got rid of some of the infections by getting rid of that whole folder. So I'm going to carry on. I'm going to use the down key and I'm just going to scroll down until I see the next one, Reveal and Finder. OK, so there we go again. So Reveal and Finder. And same thing again. I'm going to scroll backwards until I see, there we go, and this one's a plug-in, and I'm gonna get rid of that, drag it down to the bin, that's that gone, and again, I'm gonna go back here, and press down, 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 that review and finder, so there's another one. Uh, okay, so this one again, it looks like a plug-in, I'm gonna get rid of that one. Down, 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 and that's it, all gone. So uh, next important step is for me to empty the recycle bin because what you'll find in my, inside my recycle bin is the infections that I got rid of. So I'm just gonna right click on my recycle bin and empty. That's it, they're gone. So next step, is for me to restart the computer. Once I've restarted the computer, I'm gonna come back in and do a deep scan. I'm not gonna bore you with that, but that's what you wanna do once you've done your restart. Okay, uh, so I'm gonna come out. I'm gonna do a restart now. And what you're gonna find is that when it comes back up, your computer, 
Um, you're going to want to go into uh, Safari, go into your preferences and make sure that you put it back to Google um, or whatever search engine you want to use and, and just make sure that all your preferences are okay within Safari. But at least then you're safe in the knowledge that you haven't got any more malicious software and your Mac will be back to working in a like fast and efficient manner like it should be. Um, so uh, hope that's helped you guys. Um, and make sure you subscribe and like my video. Thanks.